Jackson here. Mm -hmm. Two local artists are setting off on a business venture, opening a new location full of their Dia de los Muertos art. Kevin Hernandez joins us live. I was just there the other day, Kevin. I, yes, I am so excited right now because John Huerta and Pancho have been coming into Good Day Weekend for yes. years. They've been bringing their artwork to us. Yes, Cammie, you remember, but they have just recently opened up their own art gallery and they have all their artwork on display. Here to tell us more is the man behind the art, behind that beautiful mural out front, John. So tell us a little bit about your shop. Well, we moved here six months ago, and mm -hmm. we definitely needed a place to actually set up. Because any event I go out there, people mm -hmm. ask, where's your shop? They say, well, I don't have a shop. Yeah. But now, I'm so happy we set up shop. People are coming in. You know, people are recognizing that not only my work, but mm -hmm. have Cesar um, Rodriguez has his own beautiful handcrafted yes. jewelry and other, you know, vendors here. Yes. To make it like a very cultural Mercado. And we definitely needed this in Sacramento. Absolutely. Yes. But yeah, absolutely. so really excited about this coming event coming on May 4th, which is the big Cinco de Mayo event. Mm -hmm. Part of K Street is going to be blocked with music, food, and drinks and all that. I, I, did I say food? Yeah, yeah it's going to be right. plenty yeah. of food. Yeah, absolutely. Three food trucks, and it's going to be amazing. Yeah, and so you're in the, uh, the, the Placito, which yeah. is over by Culture, by mm -hmm. Chulo Baby. There's a new shop that just opened next door. Again, you have uh, you have jewelry over here, yes. handcrafted as well. So where do you get the inspiration behind new artwork? Because, you know, I'm sure, as always, you have to keep up with, you know, different exactly. pieces. So where do you get that inspiration I from? Pretty much anybody who I've known who inspired me in life, mm -hmm. I basically use them as a kind of uh, composition for my pieces. Mm -hmm. and like my latest piece is this Cassandra. Oh, that's I remember I love peacock feathers. Yes, and yes. so that I incorporate in that because that's something that I always love with peacock and plus the woman I met years ago named Cassandra because mm -hmm. she reminds me of her. That's amazing. Yeah. I love that. And then of course I want to talk about this because this is the mural that's outside the building. Now yes. I remember coming by and actually watching you work on it. It mm -hmm. is completed. So you know you had, that's obviously Frida Kahlo but where did you draw that inspiration from for this building? Well, basically, when I started doing the sketches, I wanted to, they wanted color, they wanted hummingbird, they wanted Frida. Mm -hmm. So, and then with the background, I remember doing a project like that in college years back of mm -hmm. the geometric shapes. And so I said, okay, I'm going to do triangles and I'm going to play with the colors. Mm -hmm. Like the, you see on the blue side goes blue to warm colors and then reverse it with the bird so that way they could pop out. Mm -hmm. And with a Frida, and she's always been a big, huge inspiration for me. Yeah. So, of course, she had to be the center point. And once I finished, close to finishing the mural, the last part I put in here were her eyes. And that when the mural came to life. Yeah, absolutely. It's it's gorgeous. Now, let me tell you again, if you are interested in coming out to the John Huerta Art Studio, you can do that anytime. You can purchase art. You guys also put your art on T-shirts. However, come out May 4th, as you can see right over here on the door. They have a huge Cinco de Mayo festival out here, including a band called Anything for Salinas. Yes, if you've seen Salina, if you know the movie, you know that they're going to be good. So thank you so much. Congratulations right, to both you. you and Boncho on the shop. We'll send it on back to you, ladies in studio. All right, tell them that we say hello. Thank you, KK. Grab your capes and masks for National